Mama, how are you? Can I pray with you? Everybody stretch off your hands. I've entered a certain thick forest in the rest of the spirit. And as I was getting close to a certain wooden structure, some group of people are talking. And as I was getting closer, I can hear their conversation. And I hear them saying, let's kill Veronica. Let's kill Veronica. Let's kill Veronica. And I was getting close. Someone said, let's put cancer in his breast. I was getting close. Someone said, no. Let her go for that surgery so that she would die through that surgery. And as I was getting close, someone said, let her have an accident so that she would die. And as I got close and I saw the people in the wooden structure, I saw seven of them. All of them are women. They are all naked and sitting on the floor. And I saw your picture in the midst of them. And I heard them saying, Veronica must die. And as I was looking at them, I don't know who is called Veronica. I don't know. But as I was looking at them, I saw an angel appeared, took your picture away. And I heard God telling me, any plan they plant against Veronica has been cancelled. Amen. Oh, somebody clap your hands for Jesus. Amen. Madam, there is an attack over your life. All your dreams, you dream, is telling you that something is not right. Recently, you had a dream. You have a cousin who died some time ago. You saw that person in your dream talking to you. As a matter of fact, of late, you see dead people. People who are dead in your dream. The Lord is telling you that it's a spirit of death. And you need to pray about it. But God told me to tell you, whoever is responsible, he's sending it back to the sun. Amen! Oh, somebody clap your hands and celebrate. Please be on your feet. Mama, this year don't travel because you were going to travel, but you won't come back. You will die. In your hometown, you won't come back. You will die. There's a plot against you. All these women I saw, they are all your family members. And they are working to kill you. But I'll see as the Lord. You will live long. You will live long. Please stretch off your hands. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the weapon of the enemy. In the weapon of the enemy. We cancel it. We cancel it. Right now. Right now. Is there somebody here who has a brother called Teoflos? Teoflos. Who? No. You have a brother called Teoflos. Where is Teoflos? Stand here. We we'll pray for Teoflos. I saw somebody shot him. In a club. Three times. Please stretch off your hands. We cancel it. Amen.
clap your hands and cancel it. Katajad. Veronica, Me. you are Veronica. Come on, clap your hands for Jesus. Amen. Oh, somebody clap your hands for Glory. Jesus. Glory. Mama, when do you plan to go? Next year. Next year. Okay. Lift up your hands. You will live long. Amen. You will not die before your time. You are a great woman. Yes, Lord. Lift her up. Jesus. I cancel spirit of death. Jesus. Break! Jesus. I cancel it. Yes, Lord. You will not die. Yes, Lord. Thou seest the Lord. Amen. You will not die. Yes, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. Break! Jesus. Lift her. I hear a man's name. I don't know why a man's name is on you. I hear Richard. I hear Richard. Richard. I don't know who is called Richard. Break! Jesus. Do you know anyone called Richard? Huh? I am Richard. You are Richard. Amen. Come on, somebody clap your hands for Jesus. Oh, are you clapping? God said I should tell Richard she will not die. Amen. Mama, you are free. Amen. You will live long. Amen. Amen. Oh, somebody celebrate God. My dear, come. Come, let me talk. Yes. There is a surgery ahead of you. And I want to cancel it. Okay. If we don't pray for you, you go for a surgery in your tummy. You will come back. It's an attack. Come here so that we cancel it for you. I see the doctors operating you in your stomach, in your tummy. Because I hear you spiritually saying that there's something running in your tummy. Something running in your tummy. I hear you complaining. I have a serious stomach pain. I hear you complaining there is something running. And you can't figure out what is going on in your belly. But I hear the doctor saying there is something. So they have to preach you. Look at what I saw. I saw you lying down. Spiritually, I saw an image like a smoke appeared in your room. And I saw the smoke, the smoke turn into a snake, climbed your bed. And I saw the snake beat your stomach, especially this side of your stomach. I saw the snake beat your stomach. And when the snake beat your stomach, I saw the snake injected poison in your stomach. And all of a sudden, I saw the snake disappeared. And the spirit of God ministered to me that there is a poison in your stomach. That we need to pray for you. Otherwise, you will go for a surgery. That surgery will last for three hours. But yet, you will not survive. But I thank God for today. Amen. And the grace of God in this house. Amen. Come on, somebody clap your hands for Jesus. Jesus. Oh, you are not clapping. Jesus. Oh, somebody clap. Jesus. Have you been feeling stomach pain before? Yes. Is it serious? On and off. On and off. For how long now? About a year now. A year now. Have you seen a doctor about it? Yes. What did the doctor tell you? He said me to do um, ultrasound and it come back good. What did he say? And he came back. It's a spiritual thing. It will never go till they operate you. But within that operation, 
you will not survive. But thank God for today. Amen. Can I have a bottle of water? That pain, that poison in your stomach is going to disappear. Amen. It will never come back again. Amen. Please stretch up your hands. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the poison. In the poison. We cancel it now. We cancel it Clap now. Clap your hands and cancel it. Tapa tapa tapa. Libra do shandele belebe kapaya. Mantini biya kapaya. Lord, in the poison. Lord, we cancel it now. We cancel it now. We cancel it now. Le kapaya nda baya babaya. Le kapala babaya nda babaya. Lekataya da babaya da baya randaya babaya miracle worker miracle worker miracle worker lekapaya da ya babaya lekapaya da babaya lekipara basha tapaya Jesus Jesus yes Lord but you put your right hand on where the pin is is there is the pin there yes I cancel it I cancel it. Break, Jesus! I set you free, yes, Lord, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, Lord. Then I command that pain Jesus. to leave you. Yes, Lord. Amen. 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 Listen, remove your shoe for me. Can you remove it? Remove it for me, quick. Good. Good. Come forward, please. Come forward. Step forward. Look at my eyes. Look at my eyes. Jump three times. Jump. 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 You are free. Yes, Amen. Lord. Amen. Jesus. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. That pain will never come back again. Amen. Amen. Lift it. My dear, Congratulations. Drink Amen. it. You come here and testify. You are Amen. free. Take your seat. Amen. 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 Somebody clap your hands for Jesus. Amen. Madam, I see an angel standing beside. Is are you married? You are not married. Where's your father? He's dead. Come. Who is Mr. Yeboah? Your head husband. Where is he? In Ghana. In Ghana. What is going on between you and him? When was the last time you heard from him? Kaya Bausuka. Come here. Stretch of your hands. Please stretch of your hands. Any attack coming after her, we cancel it. Jesus. Clap your hands and cancel it. Jesus, Jesus. come here. Did your father die before you got the divorce? Or you the divorce came before your dad died? No, my father died before. Your father died before the divorce came. You see, you are not married, right? You are not married. There's a reason why you are not married. And I need to break it for you. Jesus. Uh, I need to break it. And if I break it by the grace of God, you'll be free. Amen. I'm telling you. Otherwise, you can never marry. You face disappointment upon disappointment upon disappointment. Because Yeboah, eh, out of anger, did something. And that thing is after your life. I'm telling you. Out of anger. Yeboah did something. You see, what Yeboah did, he never thought of it. But what he did, the spirit in your father's house took them in the spirit and worked them against you. And that is why you're not married. I'm telling you, my dear. But today, that curse is going to be broken. Amen! Oh, somebody clap your hands and celebrate you. Amen! 
You are not clapping. Jesus. When did you divorce? How many years now? It's over 10 years. Over 10 years. And you are not married. Oh, yeah. Your boy said something out of anger. It's after your life. I'm telling you. He broke something. He broke a bottle. And that bottle he broke. He said something. And that thing is after your life. I'm seeing a smoke. Smoke following you spiritually everywhere you go. And that smoke, any man that will come to you, that smoke will drive the man away. It's a case. Please remove your shoe. Let's pray for you. Amen. Please be on your feet. Did you divorce him or he divorced you? You divorced him. You divorced him in Ghana. Who took the drinks away? Who took the drinks away? My uncle and my sister. Your uncle and your sister. And when they went there, what, what happened? What they told me that he got pissed and he broke the bottle away. He broke the bottle on you. What did he say? That they didn't tell me. They didn't tell you. He they said, said, a, yeah, he said a lot. A lot. That thing Yeboah did, he did it out of anger. But the spirit, the witches in your father's house took it. And that has been a smoke after your life. And that is why you can't get married. But today, Jesus. that joke, that curse, Amen. you broke it. Amen! Please stretch off your hand. Say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every curse. Every curse. After her life. After her life. We break it now. We break it now. Clap your hands and break it. 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 Your marriage will be very beautiful. I'm telling you. Your time has come. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let me give you this message. Do this assignment for me, okay? When we close church today, pick a telephone. Call Ghana. Call your sister Esther. You have a sister called Esther. You have a sister called Esther. Huh? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Jesus. Call her. Hey. Tell her to be very careful. Somebody wants to poison her. So tell her to be very careful. When she goes out with her friends, she should drink. Otherwise, somebody will poison her. She will die. You are free. Oh, deep. Amen. Amen. Please come. Jesus. Try and talk to Tiflos. You've been talking to him. Why have you been talking to him? I talked to him about God. And yes. How to tell he him likes friends too much. He enjoys himself. Yeah. Tell him to be careful. Otherwise, he'll be shot. Pa, 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 pa. In a nightclub. He'll follow friends to a nightclub. They'll kill him. I'm seeing from today up to September. So tell him to be careful. He's a great boy. If he can yeah. serve God well, he'll go far. Yeah. You see? You see these people that sing, these people that sing, these people that sing, like Jay-Z, like those people, he'll be like one of them. Amen. So tell him to be careful. He can sing very well. Amen. He has a voice. Amen. So tell him to be very, very careful. Amen. Okay. I use you as a point of contact. Jesus. That young man will not die. Jesus. He will live to declare the words of God. Through you, he's saved. Amen. Amen. Clap your hands for Jesus. Amen.